Lori Harvey said another one. Thank you. <laughs> Savage out here in these streets. Get your money, sis. Fuck the hater. Get your money, sis. Get your way back. Make your money move. I ain't mad at you. Yeah, it's all about the clean and get your money, sis. Get your money, sis. Fuck a hater. What's good, everybody? Welcome back to Two Cent Tuesday with Jenny, where you will be getting my unsolicited, unapologetic opinion about what's going on in the world today. If you are new to this channel, welcome. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, and don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you are notified every single time that I post a new video. And you might as well go ahead and give this video a big old thumbs up if you're still watching. Hit that thumbs up button right now, right now. And without further ado, let's get right into today's topic. Once again, the internet is going crazy, okay? Sources have leaked that Michael B. Jordan and Lori Harvey has, in fact, split up after being together for a year and a half. And the internet going crazy. Uh, the dudes is ready to line up. The sisters is like, City Girls is up another one. Um, some people are feeling bad. A lot of people are not feeling Lori Harvey right now. She, they feel like she wasted his time. Now, according to sources, they claim that Lori Harvey just is not ready to fully commit herself to Michael. And she says she just wants to have fun and still be free. But there's no hard feelings between the two shocker lori harvey's father briefly touched on the situation on his radio show and he found it hilarious saying that he needs to be more like his children and cut it off early okay that way it don't cost you anything and you ain't got to go through all the extraness so cut them off quick 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 and he thought it was hilarious um is it too soon too soon i don't know um, a lot of people did not find the humor in Steve Harvey's joke. A lot of people are even blaming Steve Harvey for Lori loving him and leaving him. And someone even went as far as to call her a demon and said, we need more women like her. Wow. I mean, it's, 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 it's crazy. I mean, poor Michael's out here looking like... Out here like selfie cute you know <laughs> and it's just like everyone is is going back and forth as if we were all in a relationship i mean we were invested you know that was his turtles he was her nugget and now boom broken up but are we really surprised I mean, a lot of people are like, what did you expect, Michael? This is what she does. He's a fool for even falling for the okie doke. Then, of course, there's the rumors that the relationship was never even real to begin with and that the contract is just up now. They ain't really break up. It's just time to part ways. They just needed him to make her look good, um, to clean up her little future image. And on the other hand, some people are feeling like, She's dead wrong for stringing this man along. And he is hurt. And we should not be making this a joking matter. So now I want to know what you guys think. Let's talk about it. In the comments down below, let me know. Do we need to start paying more attention to people's patterns? And stop thinking that we're going to be the ones to change something? Or take a chance because you never know you could be the one. I don't know. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. And I'm going to go ahead and drop my two cents in on the situation baby um you know i wasn't too fond of the relationship to begin with because that's my husband that's number one but they were cute together she's a beautiful girl however i knew that it would not last because i mean let's be real she is 25 years old michael b jordan is in his 30s his mid 30s i believe i know he's older than me um He's at a settled down age. Uh, let's take next steps 
age and right now she is turning up not to mention her track record i mean she loves them and leaves them that's what she did i mean the girl dated a father and son for crying out loud um and not for nothing the all the end all be all she is the daughter of the man who laid the blueprint for her for all women to think like a man what do you like men do you really think you have a chance against her however i do believe that think like a man is okay when you are dealing with a certain type of man he just doesn't give you that vibe but we don't know these people we don't really know what is going on in their lives we don't know michael b you know we see what we see and we see what they allow us to see but we don't really know what the two of them are like in a relationship we don't know the pros and the cons about them so we can't really judge why they broke up or saying she just she just he's just another one on the list for her um i i, I believe they really had like a genuine connection but i do believe that she is enjoying herself she is living her best life and she is going to date who she wants to date um i'm a firm believer in not wasting people's time however now if she laid it down on the table like listen i'm only here for a good time and not a long time then you can't really be mad when that time is up however if she went in with an open heart like i'm looking for this that and the third and he's under the impression that you know they're looking for a relationship that they're, they're they're building towards something more than just girlfriend boyfriend um then yeah it's kind of foul to to lead somebody on like that i will say that um but i feel like you have to pay attention to people's patterns and track records and i'm not saying you know people can't change or you won't be different for them but you just can't ignore those red flags you can't ignore those patterns and those things if you are going into a relationship and you know that this person is known for loving them and leaving them do not go in with the intent that you are going to somehow change this pattern now don't get me wrong sometimes that can happen sometimes you are the type like mm, i'm bored another one uh another one thank you but then you find that one like oh my god this person makes me want to change he makes me want to settle down or she makes me want to get married like oh you start thinking different and that's cool and that happens sometimes but you can't go in with the intent that you are now going to change this person's whole perspective on how they do things in life you can't go in there like that Pay attention to the patterns. This is what she does. I right, let me go in there mm, treading on thin ice. Don't let me not get too caught up. But I mean, we human. We catch feelings. I mean, you can't blame the man for that. However, I do feel like, you know, never think that you're going to change something. Because you can't change anybody. Only they can. And I just, I just hate waste. Like, I just don't believe in wasting people's time. I don't believe in that, and I don't like that. I don't like that for her. Like, you know, I feel like, be be honest in the, the get-go. Like, listen. Okay? No, no catchy, no feelings, because we're not doing all of that. Let's just keep it cute. Let's have fun. Let's enjoy each other. And if that's the case, don't do too much with him. Don't be giving the nicknames and the da-da-da-da-da. Don't do all that, because then he going to catch feelings. But maybe this is all her master plan. Hmm. She said Future could do it. These other men out here could do it. So why can't I do it? I don't mind. Because you know men do it all the time. But not to Michael. Michael didn't deserve that. I don't think he deserved that. Um. But yeah. I feel like you know it's a sad situation. But they young. They both young. They'll find somebody else. Then they'll both move on. And when Lori is ready to settle down, she will. Um, I just hope she doesn't regret the decision, you know, and settle down with the wrong one. Um, and it's really funny how Steve Harvey used to always say, like, I'm not giving him advice. He's going to have to figure it out on his own because he knows his daughter. 
he knew Michael B was going to be there just for maybe to like one Christmas, maybe and two Valentine's days, and then that was about it. Like he knew he wasn't gonna be around for long because he knows his child. Um regardless, I send them both healing energy. I hope everything works out for the better of them but i think it's sad and like i said i i hate to waste people i hate for people to waste my time i would never want to waste somebody's time um somebody else's time um if you have no intention on making something work with this person let it be known all right this is just gonna be a sex thing or this is just gonna be hey i see you sometime here and there but when you move in like a whole relationship but you know for a fact you're not ready to make that type of commitment but you drag this person along and do all the wifey things or the hubby things knowing damn well you don't plan on taking that next step i think that's kind of messed up i don't really like that michael b should have been a little more aware of what he was dealing with you're dealing with a monster here, okay? She is the greatest of all time. You got to be careful. Got to be careful with that Lori Harvey. With that being said, I thank you guys for watching. Make sure you follow me on all of my social medias. Everything will be in the description down below. And Jenny is out. Michael, DM me. You're available now. I will heal that hard and i'm ready i'm ready to settle i'm ready for the next step i'm ready to get married have your baby all of that so call me dm me <laughs> stupid <laughs>